Uh, can you guys give a nice warm welcome to or clap to all the other performers that are worth performing? Give it up. It's good stuff. See these guys every time I come here. But me, I'm um, in a transitional point in life, you know. Just uh, broke up with a young, beautiful, sweet, sweet, beautiful lady. And uh, it's hard out here, you know, single, by yourself, coming home by yourself, at work, you look at your phone, there's no text, there's no calls, not even a Snapchat, no whisper. So now that, you know, it's been a few months and I'm um, still positioned to see, let me, there's a, I don't want to say a notation that guys don't, you know, feel a certain way when, you know, the split of a female and a male. But no, guys, no, we feel that shit. For example, have you been in a relationship, right? Relationship ended, right? It's not just the uh, one way of the girl of, oh my god, I can't believe I would never find another one like him. Who I'm going to eat peanut butter and crackers for the like, Oh, oh, jeez, you know? Guys are the same way a little bit. I'm not going to lie. It was lovely in the beginning with her, you know. It was, got the text from her. I was like, hey, bro, let's, uh, let's go out. Yeah, fuck shit up. Let's, let's turn up, you know? And uh, this is, this is, see, when you're in a relationship, you get to, you have options, you have choices, you know? So I'm sitting here chilling. Of course, baby's on my chest, laying the chest, laying the hair, head down like this. And then I'm just uh, observing, you know, family guy, uh, a couple other arrangements, you know, I won't get into the particulars, but we're just chilling. She's laying her lovely, lovely, beautiful, just magnificent face on my chest, and it feels good. It's like it feels right. I guess it's supposed to happen. Like this is what feels good. You know what, guys? I'm a. I think I'm gonna come right and check on that one. Yes, I think I'm gonna chill with my baby. You know. And then now, chilling with the guys. Hey, you ready? Hey, hey, you ready? Hey, we gonna do the hey. You see them girl, You know. And I'm like, yes, man, yes. What? You kidding me? I'm single, but what? In there? What? Are you kidding me? But then the inside. I'm just like, you know what, I'd really rather just go home and just watch Family Guy and snuggle up and cuddle, you know. Because in the end, we all know what cuddling means, you know what I'm saying? We all know. I mean, all, all the gentlemen, it may be, um, I don't know, walking in the moonlight or, you know, but nowadays, we know what cuddling is. We get in this position, and at the end of the night, we doing some fucking. That is, that, when, when you say cuddle, that is what I imagine at the end of it. And that's what, you know, my quotation. See, when you have something consistent, it's, you know it's there. Like, you can party all night, 2, 3 a.m. in the morning. Uh, yeah, ah, 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 ah. It'd be 4, 5 in the morning, you know, getting some late night snack pizza on the side of the street. And like, man, what you gonna do, man? I'm just, I don't know, probably crash, whatever, whatever. But you know, I'm gonna go home. Just some nice, nice, warm something. So, mmm, mmm. Cause you know when you know when you when you've tasted it, when you've achieved, and you've you know got the good stuff. You can always flash back. It's like you just and you back into it. Just, uh, uh, ooh, I know you like it, girl, cause I like it too. Ooh, mm, mm, mm. That's what you know with the good stuff. So now that I'm single, it's. It's like, it's very hard. Like, he said, uh, somebody said they use dating websites. Me, it doesn't, it doesn't work for me. Because I just, I like, I see you, I see the cleavage, and I want to, I want to, but I just don't know how to get to that, you know, that transition. And it's very hard. Because I don't want to be a jerk. I don't want to be like, yo, I ain't got time for these games. Let me hit it, let me fuck, and we can both go about our business. <laughs> you know, I try to be the nice guy, like, well, um, if you come over, I could give you some back rubs, soft kisses. You know, what do you like to eat? I get all, all your snacks, all your favorite treats. Shoot, I'll even massage your scalp. <laughs> and I know you like it. You know, but that may be too soft. Because I don't know what women want nowadays. Women is it's just, uh, it's just, I just don't know what you, what, what, what do you want? What do you want? They say, oh, I just want the, the sweet guy that could tuck me in at night. But in actuality, they want, you know, the guy with a prison record, 
ain't been home since like 24 years, this one fuck, and got tattoos, tatted up like the subway of Harlem. It's just, bitch, make up your mind. So, before I get out of here, I'm going to give you all a gentleman's insight. When you approach a fine young lady, know what you want to do because they know what they want to do. They may not appear that they might know, but damn it, they know. As soon as they saw you, they know, oh, I'm going to fuck him or, oh my God, please, I hope he talks to me. Oh, please, please. So when you get out in that plane or that ocean, what do you call it, surfing, fishing, fishing, fishing for fish, when you fish for fish, just know. They have an ultimatum and you have an ultimatum. Get to your ultimatum first. Fuck all that emotion and, and being a good guy. No, because at the end of the day, when you're on your deathbed, you're going to be like, damn, I should have fucked that bitch. Or damn, I should have did that. Damn, I should have did that. So, before I leave here, in turn, get your born on and get your ultimatum.